Hey, what's going on guys? We got another vehicle spotlight for you today. 2004 Infiniti G35 on AG wheels, V2 airlift management. Let's go check this thing out. All right, so let's get into the details of this car. Uh, this vehicle actually came from Memphis. Uh, the owner went all the way down to Tennessee to pick this thing up. He was doing some research online, wanted to find something that was basically rust free, still in good shape. So I cruised all the way down there, picked this thing up. It's originally from Florida. Uh, he's only had the car for about a month now. So his main focus was basically just to get the stand set up for summer for car shows. So wheels, tires, um, all that kind of stuff. And then of course did the air ride right away on it. So if we jump into the wheels, We'll take a look at the fronts first here. Uh, he went with the avant-garde wheel, and then this one actually is the M621, and the finish is the brushed liquid silver. So if we take a peek at this one, it's pretty cool. It's got like a metallic flake, and then it has the brushed face on it. So really cool multi-spoke design, good looking wheel, nice concave, and the front size on this one is a 19 by nine and a half, and offset is plus 15. So you can see it's got real nice concave on here. We'll get you some cool shots of that. And then with this airlift system, he's able to tuck this wheel in here nice and clean, just enough to clear. And then for you airlift guys that want to know, the fender liners are still in here. So if you get a shot of that, you can see this wheel is kind of laying on the, on the fender liner in there. So I think once he pulls those, he'll be able to lay it down a little bit more. While we're checking out the front wheel brakes, he just redid these as well. Uh, it's R1 Concepts, slotted and cross-drilled. Awesome looking brake against that wheel. Brembo calipers, those are stock on these Gs. Front tire, it's a Nitto Invo tire. It's a 245-35. Uh, uh, so just enough rubber to wrap it around in there and be able to tuck it in that fender well. If we jump on to the back here, a little bit wider in the back, so 19, nine and a half in the front, 19 by 11 in the back. Offset is the same. So once again, really good concave, plus 15 back here. Same thing, fender liners are still in the back. Just enough clearance to tuck this thing in here. And he did actually roll the back fenders. So clearance is pretty spot on, fitment looks great. So staggered setup, of course, for you guys that don't know, of course, two different sizes. We'll check out the airlift. He just put this in two weeks ago, so he has to finish it up, but he does have the five gallon tank unfinished. I know he's gonna get this painted a custom color. He's got the VI Air uh, compressor. So you can see everything's a little unfinished. We'll bring you another video. We'll probably end up doing an on the low on this vehicle. So we'll probably uh, do another video two, three months here and get you the full build. He's got a lot of aero parts. He'll have the trunk finished. New hood, new diffuser. Rear spoiler, of course, is stock on the G. Exhaust is stock. Everything else for the car, he's, like I said, he only had it for about a month. So everything is pretty much OEM on it, aside from the fitment and the airlift. So like I said, he wanted to knock that out right away, get it done. We'll cruise over, we can check out the V2 airlift management system he's running. Interior is OEM as well, but you can see he's got the controller mounted here. So of course, this is how he's gonna control the PSI digital gauge here. But overall, awesome stance on this car. Good staggered setup. We do sell the Niddle Invo tires on the Fitment Inc. website, so it's a really good tire if you guys are looking for those. Unfortunately, that's not a wheel we carry yet, but we're looking into getting those soon. Appreciate you guys tuning in. That's gonna do it for this car. Make sure you guys like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and make sure to subscribe to us on the YouTube channel. We'll have more videos coming out for you guys next week. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Andrew, peace.